Welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and today I have a pretty fun Dollar Tree haul for you. I got some interesting finds that I want to share and yeah, so we'll get right into it. Today's drink is my keto version of the pink drink. It is passion tea, unsweetened, like I don't put any syrup, with a couple packets of my uh, keto friendly sweetener, some heavy cream, and a little French or just regular vanilla. I don't use the vanilla syrup most days because it has some other stuff in it. But that's what I'm drinking. And it's kind of chilly out, I'm not going to lie. All right, first thing I want to mention, I picked up another pack of these. Um, and I showed them to you before because uh, one of one of you, Peg Curry, left a comment, and it's genius. She puts them in the cup holder of her car in the summertime, and it absorbs spilled coffee, sweaty drinks, and then you throw them in the washer. Isn't that genius? So, Peg, thank you so much. So, I grabbed a pack to put in my car, in my drink holder, because I'm forever drinking coffee in the sloshes. So, I grabbed these. They come in three packs. So I have, um, excuse me, my allergies today. I have, um, I'll use two of them and then the third one for my, wash my face. Um, the other thing I have already opened, I bought these. These are LA Colors. They're the Art Deco. And I will tell you, this hand is a little rough because my, um, <laughs> I can't use my left arm very good. But I did a French manicure with them. And then this nail, I added a little pink. I'm not sure if you're able to see it. But it works really well. It's very good. It's opaque. Um, yeah, it takes a little while to dry. It's thick, so it does take some time. But I got a white and a pink, and I've used them, and they're awesome. So we'll put those over here. Got that out of the way. Um, some other makeup products I got was some of this Revlon. I'm obsessed with the seafoam green and it comes with nail polish on one end and then the glitter on the other. Um, it's called Sun Candy. I don't know. I'm assuming the brush is in the middle. Yeah. So the brush is in the middle, but this is Revlon brand. They had a navy blue, but I have navy blue nail polish, but I don't have whatever this color is supposed to be, which is doesn't say what the color, if there's a color name, it does not say. But it's nail polish on one end and then the glitter top coat on the other. So I grabbed that for me. I enjoy painting my nails. Um, and on the last, well, I got some band-aids. These are not makeup, but they're in the health aisle. And I got the ones with all the peanuts on them. My, knee, my hands get dry and crack. I go through a lot of band-aids, especially when the seasons change. Um, because I'll put a little bit of like uh, Neosporin and then put a band-aid on it. And why not have fun band-aids? So I grab these and this. there's four bonus in this, so it's a 20-pack. I'm not sure what the brand is. Um, just says, oh, let's look at the bottom. United Exchange Core, peanuts.com. So I grabbed those. Um, for my little cousin, I got her the hibiscus pink clay face wipes. She's at that age now. She needs to start caring about her skin. Um, so I got her these to try. If she likes them, I can pick those up for her. And then the last thing I picked up was this. This is Sinful Colors. And I don't know if you know or not because I just figured it out. It's Revlon. It says on the back, the original Revlon product has been repackaged, not under license. So if you see the Sinful Colors, it's actually Revlon. And I got, this is Pout Play Iridescent Lip Color. I don't need any more makeup. My couponing, I get plenty, but that lip look, color looked cute for summer. So I thought that was fun. So I grabbed that. But I was it was very interesting to me that this is actually Revlon repackaged. So that's pretty cool. So I did that. Oh, I do have one more thing. One more health and beauty. 
I picked up this hair mask by Hask for Sarah, my niece. So I'm putting together, and I'll show you, um, the flora books that I got. And I'm taping a pen on the front that I called, I love these pens, I hauled from the Dollar Tree. These are the Color Flow Quick Drying No Bleed Felt Tips. I love these, they write in a really nice black. And these are 0.5 millimeter. So I grabbed two packs of these because I have four books. So everybody's getting a notebook with a pen on the front. And I picked up these masks at CVS. They were on regularly $4.99 on clearance for 99 cents. So everybody's getting a mask. Sarah will get this notebook because she needs that in her life. And she will get a hair mask. She'll get some extra things in her little bag. Um, and also I purchased four of these Zen candles and everybody's going to get a Zen candle. They smell pretty good. It's, um, white ginger amber. If I was able to, I was watching Whitney and Wit, Whiskey and Wit, Whiskey and Wit channel. And she peeled off this label and took her Cricut and put her own saying on it. And if I was able to crick it right now I would but I'm not so I won't I'm not frustrating myself so they'll like the Zen so everybody's getting a candle as well um, I just thought it would be super cute and springy they don't have children yet but they're all dog moms so this is like a little Mother's Day and then I picked up to put everybody's in two packages of um, the gift bags so Everybody, I wrote their name on them already. This is, there's actually two Sarahs. My Sarah says Cuppy Cake. So everybody's going to get a bag with their book, you know, with their goodies in it. Um, and this is the washi tape I use. I just pulled it out of my stash. It's a unicorn head because, well, duh, you need that. Um, I am all over the place today. I picked up a set of the blocks. This is going to be for a Christmas DIY. So I grabbed those while I saw them. And then I picked up a six pack of these. These were great. They are, um, you sit your plants in them if you have a drainage hole in the bottom. And this will catch any moisture. And so I use these fairly regularly. Um, but I needed some more of the smaller. And the small ones come in a six pack, which is great. Um, they work wonderful. They're pretty thin. So if you want to use two of them, you can let's see if I get oops get these separated. Yeah, so they're pretty thin, but to be honest, all they're gonna do is sit on my windowsill, and a plant will sit in them, and this will catch any overflow water. So I grabbed the pack of those. I got for my coffee station, and this is glass uh, ceramic. It says, okay, but first coffee in the gold. I love it. And I'll put this with my coffee station. I grabbed that for me. Um, and speaking of coffee, I grabbed these coffee cups. I don't know how great of quality they're going to be. Um, but they hold a fair amount. The travel mug, it doesn't say. If I had to guess, I would say they're 12 ounces. Um, but I wanted this green for Pelotonia, that fundraiser that I do. So I grabbed two. Uh, once I get my use of my arm back, I will cricket this for my cousin and I because we both ride. And I'm making her and I just some mugs to have. We like swag. Um, I mean, they're not great. They're a buck. And then I bought this one maybe for vacation. I liked the color. And if we're being truthful, I have a I have a mug problem. It's true. Um, I also have an allergy issue, so I bought a box of tissue that says home is where uh, the heart is. Now, these fit in my console. I have a ton of tissues downstairs, but none this size uh, from Coupon, but these fit in my middle console. So that's why I purchased that size. And they're only a dollar. I <sighs> grabbed some garlic salt in a 13 ounce. That's a great deal. It's a lot of garlic salts, but I love it. So I grabbed that and this is Supreme Tradition, which I believe is a green briar. Yeah, it's a green briar. 
But then they also had garlic and herb all-purpose seasoning in the Kingsford brand. So I grabbed one of those. These don't tend to stick around long. And I think these will be yummy for like grilling and stuff. So I grabbed one of those. Because ugh, I enjoy spices and seasoning. Okay. For Easter, which you'll see this after Easter. But going to my nieces, so I grabbed... Just this, I'm making deviled eggs because that's definitely something I can handle. And I'll just leave this with her. I'll cover it, take it, and leave it. I love Dollar Tree um, serving things for that purpose that I don't have to worry about bringing it home. If I bring it home, it's great. But if I don't, I'm so not worried about it. So I grab one of those. And then for my Christmas gift that I'm putting together, the cleaning kits, I grabbed two of these. I love these cloths. They had them out last year in the white. They're great, especially for like stainless steel, wiping down your counters. But I love the colors this year, the blue and the green. And these are not a green briar. It just says multi-purpose, ideal for wood, glass, leather, electronics, auto, use wet or dry, highly absorbent, soft material. And they're lint so I grabbed um, three of them, one for me and then one for each of my cleaning kits that I'm putting together with all the natural cleaning products for Christmas for a couple family members. Um, so I'll use one. And actually what's so funny is I had the white ones and they're folded up at the bottom of the buckets I'm making just to absorb any liquids. So that is more for that. I'm almost done with that gift, which is pretty exciting. I'll just keep picking up stuff as I find it, but these... I enjoy cleaning with those. Um, I picked up to go with the yellow bag some green um, tissue paper for the girls' gifts that I'm putting together here pretty soon. Like as soon as I'm done making this video. So I grabbed these because I think it makes it look like a daffodil for spring. So I grabbed that. And then the last of the, nope, not the last, not the last. Let me get that over here. I found, so everybody that I was watching has been hauling this Final Touch Oxy Stain Remover. Being keto, I get a lot of grease on my clothes from bacon, I cook a lot, and I go through a lot of spray and wash, just pre-treating, and it's expensive. So we're going to try this Final Touch brand Oxy Stain Remover Light Fresh Scent. I just found this today. But yesterday I was at a different Dollar Tree and they had a totally awesome laundry pre-wash stain remover that I have not seen anybody haul. So I have two to try and still less than the cost of one spray and wash. So we'll, I'm almost out of the bottle that I'm currently using and so we'll try one of these and see how they work. Um, I don't know, it just says eliminates tough stains. Um, I love the LA's Totally Awesome product. They're a little harsh, but I do like the Totally Awesome Cleaner to get like grease and stuff off of pans. Um, that's one place I don't use a natural cleaner, just especially if I'm doing bacon. So anyway, I have two of these to try now. And then for my car, I picked up the Ready Wipes. Um, I like to have things, you know, wipe your hands and whatnot. So I'll put these out in my car. This is antibacterial hand wipes, fresh scent, alcohol free. Kills 99% of germs, 50 soft wipes. Excuse me, I just hiccuped. So I grabbed one of those. Now we're in the final straw. I finally found the llamas. The stickers. I got one of these with the succulents and the llama and the hat. Look at these stickers. Aren't they adorable? So I grabbed one of those. And then I grabbed one spiral notebook with all the llamas on the front. And it says, no prob llama. I love llamas. So I grabbed one of these for me. And then for the giveaway, for my 5,000 subscriber giveaway, I grabbed one of these. No problem journals. I actually already have one of these for me, but um, this is going with the giveaway. Oh, Cause I love it. Isn't that adorable? And I would take it out, but it's a gift. It's a journal. It's lined paper, and on the sheets of paper in the corner, there's like little succulents. So I just thought that was super cute. So I have that going in the giveaway bucket. 
And the last thing I purchased were some note cards. These are Hallmark Expressions. They're regularly $3.89. I love a blank note card, especially with my fundraiser that I do. I like sending out um, thank you cards. And these are actually going to go in a little note for the girls. And then what's left goes into my box of notes. Generally, I try to get ones that say thank you on the front or whatever. When I get a donation, I mail out a thank you card. Um, but these will go in there too. But these are so pretty. I just think they scream spring. So I'm going to need to fill those out tonight. Get all of my gifting together before Sunday. And I'm going to take it to Sarah's for Easter. And then again, like I said, you'll probably see this Monday or Tuesday. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all had a great weekend, a great Easter. And are ready for spring like I am. Because right now I think it's 50 degrees and probably going to snow. It's so cold here right now. But whatever. We'll deal with it. All right, everybody, you have a good one. I will talk to you later. Bye. Toodaloo.